officer's log 6933. We've done it. We're down on the surface and the habitats are all fully operational. No more supply runs to the ship and back. Uh, we've established five settlements in this region with another ten spread across the other regions. The elected leaders of each group have voted and declared the mission a success. Many of the settlements have decommissioned their landers as a sign of this, even holding ceremonies to celebrate our new life here. However, it appears our new home may not be as welcoming as we had hoped for. Much of the indigenous flora and fauna have proven to be toxic and highly aggressive. Several of the crew have been attacked while gathering food and supplies, and we've lost a few people to various incidents involving local plant life. Settlement Alpha and Beta have also been having problems with animal attacks. I mean, by all accounts, they've had it worse than us, with entire teams being lost. We've posted additional sentries to guard the settlement, but we're not a military operation. We're explorers and colonists. The best we have is an ex-security officer to keep us safe. We were simply not expecting such a hostile environment. Medical officers lock 7463. The creatures got into our habitat. God, it, it was a massacre. So many dead women, children, that they ate. Medical officer's log is 7467. We reached Settlement Delta this morning. Uh, only... Uh, there's no one here. Uh, there are signs of what looks like a fight and barricades in some of the bigger buildings. Uh, it looks like they tried to use the main habit as shelter. Uh, but whatever attacked them tunneled in through the floors. I can't shake the feeling that these animals are watching us, and biding their time. It feels like we're being hunted. Yeah, at least the rumors about the launch are true. It, it's here and fully intact. It seems as if our friends had turned it into a monument rather than break it down like the rest of us did. We've managed to locate the orbiting ship's beacon and made the necessary calculations for a launch. Our only problem is the fuel cells. They're dry. Huke, our engineer, seems to think he can get some from the other building in the settlement. It will just take a little time, a, a couple of days, maybe. I mean, all we can do is wait and keep our guard up until we can get off this planet.